Hey what's up everyone, so welcome back to another video and today I'm gonna show you how to install Pokemon Go for Windows 10 Mobile and this uh, version it's not official one so it's made for a third party developer take in mind that uh, this uh, Pokemon Go it's not available for Windows Phone 8 or 8.1 so don't ask me on the comments if it's available for that because it's not, it's only for Windows 10 Mobile uh, and first thing I'm gonna do is go into the storage and change the apps that to save into the device because if they will if they are going to save on SD card, it will give you an error, so make sure you change to this device. Um, I did all that already. And then in second place, go into the file browser, not file browser, but go and download the files that I'm, give you, I'm gonna leave in the descriptions. That will be these three files, and they are 24 uh, megabytes, 25 megabytes, 1.81 megabytes, and 7. Uh, 45 megabytes you're gonna need all these three files once you download them place them all three in the same folder I place them as you can see in downloads you can place them wherever you want and then third thing you're gonna do is let's uh, move this thing uh, go in update and security and for developers and you might you should have this option here Windows Windows Store apps choose developer mode turn yes and then device recovery also turn on it takes like a few as, as you can see it takes like a few seconds to turn on and then also turn device portal on after that copy this uh, IP this IP you can copy you can also do with your uh, laptop PC if you are in the same Wi-Fi I'm gonna do straight here on the phone let me copy the IP here so I know it I copy it here so I know the IP uh, let's go now in the browser so you don't need a PC really to install this one I already went but le let's go again 192.168.0.24 this is the IP that it's for me for you might be different and see here try to zoom in a little bit yeah, it says there is a problem with this blah blah blah, but you just press here continue Continue with this web page and it goes to the next part which you need now uh, This uh, password and this password you're gonna get it by let's go back to those settings and Here you press on pair and you're gonna get this uh, password type it also. I'm gonna type it also 4g 2c2 I typed it here now let's go back don't cancel go back to the browser let's zoom in again focus and let's type in the password uh, take in mind that these passwords they are uh, very sensitive so if there there is small letters or bigger letters you must type them as well to see as you can see I type all ta capital letters because the password was all capital letters but uh, you might need only small letters and we got into this menu now go here at app let's try to zoom in ah he went back i hate when i go back fuck man <laughs> okay going to apps okay and now here we get we have this menu and see, you see here install apps let's try to maybe focus again because i'm not sure if it's focused or not okay now go here browse and it will open this menu go into the device or where you save the files uh, I save them in the downloads ok open downloads and then choose first this bigger file at 25 megabytes which is Pokemon Go press at the bottom yes um, and then here add dependency let's go add dependency let's add straight to columns go in the first one browse again this device uh, downloads and now add the second one which is 1.81 megabytes press again yes and then on the third one again same thing this device downloads and now add the last one which is 7.45 megabytes okay and now you can press here at the bottom deploy and the button go as you can see it's uploading I hope it's focused because I'm not sure if it's focused uploading 
and uh, after uploading it will start to install and then the game will be on your library. Let's just wait and see. Okay, so it's done. It says you can now press go to install something else, but don't press. Just get out of it and scroll into the, your applications and here it is, Pokemon Go. You can zoom out already because there is no white. Uh, let's focus again. And now when you start the application, it will go to the login menu, which this login menu, you can't really create an account. So you must have a, already an account. The way to create an account is you create either on Android or you create on the Pokemon Go website and then use BlueStacks to emulate the Android apps on your PC and then what you need to do is just log in into the into the game already uh, the first thing you're gonna do is like you, you're gonna catch a Pokemon Pokemon's here I did ca catch already a Charmander um, after you catch that Pokemon you just go here settings and then you must you must sign out just sign out, yes, because uh, the game doesn't allow to be logged in into two devices at the same time. And now let's uh, put here my username, uh, I hope I don't forget it. Okay, and now let's hope at the bottom it is logged in, let's press logged in. And yeah, and we need permission for your location. Press yes, and the game should get into the game. But um, I've read I read already on the internet that the application at the moment uh, it crashes when you are on Wi-Fi. So I I am right now at, on Wi-Fi, uh, but you can use like the your data 3G or 4G, and it doesn't crash there but I don't have at the moment 3G or 4G like and I'm gonna try to use Wi-Fi but it might crash so let's uh, see okay so it started but I'm I, I think it's gonna crash because I'm on Wi-Fi but let's see but as you can see it started the same username as was there but as you can see the app works it's not the best right there but at the moment it's the only, the only you can use for windows okay so anyway uh, <laughs> this tutorial was to, to show you how to install the application uh, but at the moment as you can see it kind of freezed out uh, because i'm using wi-fi but uh, people to say it already who tested their application that uh, if you use the 3G or 4G, uh, it works properly, but with, in Wi-Fi it crashes. So hopefully the developer will do an update, a future update on the application. Uh, but so far, this is the only way to, to play Pokemon Go in the Windows devices. And again, this uh, only works for Windows 10 Mobile, doesn't work for Windows Phone 8 or 8.1. So don't ask about that. So yeah, thank you guys for watching and see you in the next one.